guys, I am Krista. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are if you are new to my YouTube channel, please subscribe. Hit that subscribe button. Um do click the bell. Hit the bell too and it'll give you actually it'll actually give you a notify. <laughs> it'll give you a notify if you are like if I upload new videos and also give it a thumbs up to support my YouTube channel and um just subscribe, um, subscribe, hit the bell, thumbs up, and that will support my YouTube channel so much. I need support, and thank you if you do and will. Thank you. Let's get started. So, where should I start? This is my cat named Simba. I just want you to introduce. If you are new to the channel, subscribe, and you can look at all my videos. When you subscribe, I'll upload new videos for you to see, right? Is that right, Simba? <laughs> yes, his name's Simba. All right, where should I start? This is a video on how to take care of your elf. So the number first rule, the number one first rule is, don't do that. The number one first rule is, um, don't bite me. The number one first rule is do not touch your elf. That is the rule. If the number first one rule, I don't know, like, I don't know, like something else, that's not true. It's not right. It's maybe it's maybe wrong. But number one first ever rule a elf could tell you is do not touch them. So I never actually touched my elves. I have two elves. One is named Roxy. One is named Jingles. You might have heard of Jingles or Jingle. Um, yes, I have two elves named Roxy and Jingles, both boy and girl. Jingles is the boy. Roxy is the girl. And yes, one belong, one elf belongs to my brother, one elf belongs to me, and yes, so let's get started as usual. So the number one rule is don't touch your elf. If you do touch your elf, this is what you can do. These are many problems you can solve. So first what you have to do is write a note to Santa, all right, just write a note to Santa saying that you're sorry maybe like write a sorry note and another way i've heard from this video that so like if your elf falls for example so my elf jingles actually fall fell off my mirror and i told my mom to put it back up and she did and you know what happens if your elf falls tell a parent let them wear gloves or just you can even do it without gloves i would recommend to be safer and not to lose its magic by doing that by like putting gloves and yes Santa will restore the magic if um, you say sorry and he can always he, he can solve problems with elves and if your elf falls these are two ways your your mom or dad can your parents can pick them up put them back on the shelf um, it won't affect the elf much when a parent does it but when a kid does it it's not good to trust kids to do it I'm not trying to be I'm not trying to be mean to little kids but they shouldn't because they will lose their magic. You might be thinking, why would parents get to but not kids? Well, it's something that Santa would want parents to only do. All right? <laughs> Socks, don't scratch the door. That is my dog. He always does that. <laughs> it's okay if you hear him. I hope it's okay. Sorry. Um, sorry. So, um, so, yes. So, get a parent. And you know what else? So, this is something that people have been saying in YouTube. So this is one of the things people have been, been, been saying. So take the elf, like make your parents take the elf to your table. So lay your elf on the table, put a cloth, then lay your elf on the table, then sprinkle, like if you have cinnamon, then you sprinkle it. But I don't have cinnamon because I can trust myself because I never touch my elves in my life. Like, I don't think so. Maybe one time I did, and I think Santa restored its magic. I think that was Roxy. I don't know. But yes, sprinkle some cinnamon, then put it in a comfortable spot on the shelf or wherever it was before and when it was touched. All right? So that's another way. And another way how to take care of your elf socks. Another way to take care of your elf is to maybe give your elf a present. I don't know. I give my elf, uh, elf, I give my elves, the girl elf, I give my elf a dress, I give my boy, I give my boy elf, um, what do I give him? I give him a blanket and some comfy pillow, like, I do everything for them, and you could even give them cookies, it'll support them, 
because it's being nice and kind, right? You want you want to be kind to your elves. You don't want to be naughty and mean, right? So yeah, that's something that you could be looking forward to. Um, if you don't have an elf um, that visits you during December, don't worry. It's probably because you're so well behaved that you don't actually need an elf watching over you. Because I have elves because sometimes I feel, you know, kind of naughty. Um, yeah, kind of do. Um, but... You know, people like if you, for example, if you don't have an elf, it's it's a great like it's good news when you don't have an elf. I'm not trying to be mean to the elves, but it's a good thing if you don't have an elf. You know why? You know why? Because because um, that means you're well behaved that you don't actually need someone, something watch over watching over you. So that's why it's well well behaved. Thank you so much much for watching my video um i might do a video on like looking at my elves you can meet my elves i might do a video on that and i just might and i might even do more videos but thank you for listening so so much even my cat samba says bye even my dog samba says bye <laughs> but thank you so so much for watching um remember like i said subscribe hit that subscribe button that will, when you subscribe and um click the thumbs up and hit the bell especially subscribing and hitting the bell especially so please subscribe because when i when you subscribe you're supporting my channel as a nice person and you can even be one of my helpers if i accept it all right thank you so much for su supporting this channel remember to subscribe hit the bell hit the um, like give it a like and thank you so so much i might do this next december like Maybe on how some so you know guys um some elves some elves actually come back um during November on Thanksgiving if you like maybe do like um a note an early note maybe or just try to get your elf back early and yes thank you so 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 much for watching I really appreciate it remember to subscribe hit that bell hit that um hit that I keep forgetting it hit that thumbs up. But please subscribe. You can be one of my helpers if I accept it. And just please subscribe because it's supporting my channel so, so very much. And thank you so much for being a nice person and helper. Thank you. And please enjoy your day. And yes, bye.